Hello, I'm Dragos and in this video we are going to see how you can configure Postfix to send emails using an external SMTP server. If you don't know, Postfix uh, can send uh, emails from your servers with some configurations using an external SMTP provider. You may want to configure Postfix to send emails on your VPS server, to have uh, scripts that are running there send emails, to have uh, applications that are running in there to be able to send emails. Some of the applications maybe don't have an SMTP configurations in, in there and you may want to configure Postfix at server level to send emails. And uh, lately there are a lot of SMTP providers that exist and are offering uh, free email services. So basically you can uh, have this configured for free, like this I have it on my servers and you can um, send uh, hundreds of emails a day for, for free with these SMTP providers. And uh, in here I have created an article with all of these uh, details and um, yeah, you may want to use Postfix because it's easy to configure, it handles your emails, you want to use as an uh, SMTP external provider because you don't want to have your email server configured by uh, by you because you may see problems with uh, emails reaching uh, spam folder and uh, that's why it's better to use an SMTP external providers. There are a lot of SMTP external providers that can be can be used. In this section I've created a list with the ones that I am using and tested myself. So the first one it's Bravo and this one it's offering like uh, 300 emails per day and you have 9000 per, per month so this can be more than enough to to, to use in a VPS server that doesn't send a lot of emails. I'm using this on some of the VPS servers that I host on Hesner. The second one, it's a Zepto mail. This is from Zoho and uh, yeah, it offers you a possibility in the beginning to have like 10,000 free emails. And uh, after you can buy bulk of 10,000 emails with only $2.5. And the other one, it's MailBay. I've also created a video in the past with this one. Basically, for this one, you are just paying $1 a month and then you are just paying for the usage. The other one that it's uh, well known, it's Amazon SES. And uh, yeah, this one's also having a free tire with uh, 62,000 free emails. And uh, there are some others like Mailgun with 5,000 emails for three months, SendGrid with 100 emails per day. So. Yeah, all of these services are offering uh, some uh, free tires that you can use to configure Postfix to send uh, emails. And uh, in here we'll see the manual configurations and I also have a script created by me and uh, it's held under this uh, this domain utils.bidos.com and in here you have the script that will help you configure all of these things easily, it will just prompt you for, for the details and it will configure everything for you. This script is tested uh, on uh, Ubuntu and it works uh, perfectly with Ubuntu. We are going to see how we can use it and configure Postfix. But in the beginning, we are just going to see some of the things that you need so you can understand uh, what it needs to be done to have Postfix configured. So Postfix first needs to be installed and yeah, based on the VPS that you have, you just run the apt-get or uh, yum install and uh, you then you will have a Postfix main configuration file and in here you need to set some things like the relay host and uh, these are the configurations that will need to be set in the main.cf. Again, I have a script created that will help you do this with just one click. We are going to see in the in the next part how you can run it and how it's working. Then you just create a password file with the SMTP provider and the username and password. You are just uh, encrypting the password. Then you are assigning the rights on this file so it can be read by Postfix. Here you have some options in the in the steps in here, basically, uh, if you want to use a default uh, from address, you can configure it in Postfix in these configuration files. And uh, yeah, the thing with this is like, uh, if you want to use uh, a from address that will be used all the time, you can also follow these steps. Also the script, it has uh, these options. If you don't set anything in there, it will not configure it, this for you. And then you need to activate this configuration in the Postfix configuration file with this 
commands and then um, you are just adding the domain that it's sending the email in mail name in this file. So then you are just restarting Postfix. So it's not that complicated to configure Postfix to use the email provider. And uh, in here I have the script. Again, it's on my uh, site. It's free to use and it's open source. You can uh, check it. You can uh, open a problem if you have pro if you have seen any issues with it. And um, yeah, you just need to download it and uh, run it on your server. And in here I have Hasner and I have a VPS already created. And uh, this one it's an Ubuntu test machine and you don't have Postfix configured in here. We are just going to see how you can configure this easily. And we are going to use Brevo for this. I already have a domain configured in, in Brevo. First, you need to add your domain into the SMTP uh, provider that it helps you send, uh, send emails. And I already have this done for a domain that I am uh, using for, for this. So yeah, in this uh, video, we're going to see how we can configure this. So let's go and the first thing it will be to connect to the VPS server. So in here I have a terminal open and I will just connect uh, to my uh, server. You need to have root rights to do that, to run the script. And in here you have the server uh, accessed and uh, let's go and uh, follow the instructions from my blog. So first thing, we are going to fetch the configuration file that we are going to, to use for this. And then we are going to paste it in here. This will just download the script. Then we will go and uh, make it executable. And then we are just going to run it and we are going to see what this script is asking us to, to do. Let me make this configurable. Let me run this. So bash with the script name like this. And right now you should provide a username for this. The username it's in uh, Brevo. If you want to use Brevo, you can use this with any other provider you may have. So the username is this one in my case. And I'll put it in here. Then you should uh, put a password and uh, let's uh, generate an API key for this, generate a new SMTP and I'll put a test in here. I'll generate one. I will copy this and then we're going to go in here and we're going to paste it. This is not shown in here because you don't want to, to have this uh, displayed to, to others. And right now we're going to use the domain that we want uh, to send emails from. And in my case, it will be bidoz.ro. And then uh, you want to add the sender email address. This is optional. If you don't send one, you can let your application or the script use one. I will not set one in, uh, in this case. And then you add again the domain. And in here, you just need to add the SMTP provider with the port. In my case, I will use the Brevo credentials and I have already created. You need to provide these strings with the brackets and with the semicolon and the port. And let me fetch the one that I have already created for this. like this and we move this so you can see so I will hit enter and right now this will go and uh, install all the packages that are needed and it will go and uh, configure the postfix service to send emails this should take uh, like one minute or so it shouldn't take a lot And let's wait for this to, to finish. So right now the postfix is restarted. It's creating the password file with the details. So right now everything it is done and postfix should be able to send uh, emails. So in the article in here, I've added also the 
details of how you can test this. So if you want to send a test email, this is without a from, if you want to use a from. In here I have a test script that we are going to use, so in here you see that it's just echoing a message, it will use the mail to send the email, it will have a subject, in here it will have the minus R to send the from address in the script, and this is the recipient name, and uh, I have already created all of this with my test email, and then we are going to open the terminal and we are just going to hit this, right now an email should have been sent, to check the logs, you can do that with the tail minus 100 var log mail log, this is the mail log, and first we are going to check in here to see if we have a successful response, okay, and uh, in here you see that uh, the postfix it has uh, sent the email successfully, you see in here that it was quad to, to be sent, and you can go and see if the logs are showing the details, And you see in here that an email was delivered to my inbox and we can go and check that. You have the email that reached the inbox and right now the emails can be sent from the VPS server easily and uh, yeah, you can start using the script on, uh, on your servers also. And uh, yeah, that's all that uh, you need to do to configure Postfix to use an external SMTP provider to send emails. I hope you enjoy the video and in case uh, you like what we have seen, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, you have uh, at the end some videos that will help you configure various ser services in there. Thanks for watching and uh, see you in the next video.